Chino Valley Fire is not only committed to preserving life, but also preserving quality of life. Chino Valley Fire is one of the best fire departments in the state of California. Independent Fire District, it's great for city efforts, both Chino and Chino Hills. They are a special district. They can focus on providing to the community the best firefighting services available in California. Life safety for our residents. That's always been the number one position for them. For over 20 plus years, I've been in elective service. Their commitment has been consistent, providing those services to the highest degree for our residents of San Bernardino County. We understand it takes a system to save a life. This includes the community, local officials, law enforcement, transportation partners, and hospitals. Through this approach, we have seen a consistent improvement each year since we began a community-based approach to managing sudden cardiac arrest. This remarkable feat is a testament to the Chino Valley Fire Board of Directors and the continuous effort, dedication, and training of all Chino Valley firefighters. Fire District has the best equipment and the best firefighters from all over the state coming here and I think because of our resources that are available to the fire district that provides that confidence for the community that we're hiring the best and because of that the best will stay also. An important component of our commitment to life is preparedness. As a board we are entrusted to establishing service levels and ensuring we have the resources needed to serve our growing communities. Chino Valley Fire is in the construction document phase of an 8th fire station and a central resource facility. Construction of Fire Station 68 in Chino Hills is at the intersection of Soco Canyon Parkway and Pipeline Avenue. The apparatus housed at Fire Station 68 will serve as a multidisciplinary firefighting apparatus and is projected to decrease the response times in the southern part of the district by 12 to 14 minutes. The flexible design elements of the facility will enable the transition from storage to an incident command post and a safe refuge for initial attack wildland fire crews when large-scale wildland fires impact our community. It will also include a much-needed multi-purpose essential resource facility designed to house reserve fire engines, paramedic squads, ambulances, and emergency supplies. The fire station layout will boast flexible design capabilities that will allow the building to evolve as needed to best serve the community well into the future. And we're excited that this new station will be coming in in the next year and a half to two years. The Chino Valley Fire District has a long history of delivering advanced medical and emergency services to residents of the Chino Valley. During the early 1970s, when a pilot study indicated that the fire service agencies were the most effective way to deliver advanced cardiac life support, Chino Valley Fire wasted no time. The district sent three firefighters to Loma Linda Medical Center for paramedic training. By early summer of 1975, six Chino Valley firefighters had been trained in the new paradigm of advanced cardiac life support. With the newly trained paramedics on staff, the district became one of the first fire agencies in Southern California to deploy a two-person rescue squad on all rescue calls. By August 1975, the Chino Valley Fire District became the first agency to provide 24-hour paramedic service to all western San Bernardino County. Through the years, Chino Valley Fire has continued to embrace innovative practices to deliver the highest level of paramedic services. Today, 98% of Chino Valley firefighters are trained paramedics. This has resulted in a substantial increase in survival rates from sudden cardiac arrest. Our relentless pursuit of best industry practices puts Chino Valley Fire at the forefront of paramedic services and truly highlights our commitment to preserving life. The great thing about Chino Valley Independent Fire District is they are willing to try on and be the first at many different programs. When that's deploying life-saving equipment throughout our region, training their paramedics to be the top-line first responders. Chino Valley's commitment to life extends to teaching communities we serve potentially life-saving skills like hands-only CPR. Research shows that hands-only CPR may result in the delivery of a greater number of chest compressions with fewer interruptions for the first several minutes 
after adult out of hospital cardiac arrest. Our firefighters join local partner agencies and Pomona Valley Medical Center to host sidewalk CPR throughout Chino Valley. We want to meet the community where they are and provide potentially life-saving skills to them at no cost so that together we can strengthen the chain of survival. In 2022, we taught over a thousand community members and local high school students how to perform hands-only CPR. Chino Valley personnel didn't stop there. We conducted several fire and life safety presentations throughout the community to ensure all population segments have the knowledge they need to prepare for an emergency they face. In addition, we visited several of our local schools to teach valuable safety lessons and to answer questions about the fire service for students interested in becoming firefighter paramedics. We also visit our local senior centers and homes to connect with the senior population. We are proud of the Remembering When program established for our seniors. In 2022, the Chino Valley personnel installed over 100 smoke alarms and provided residents with smoke alarm test sticks, smoke alarm batteries, night lights, bath mats, electric strip outlets, and secure rug mats. The items supplied to the Chino Valley residents help mitigate the fire and fall danger that older adults face. In 2022 alone, we reached over 11,000 community members of all ages with valuable safety information ranging from how to use a fire extinguisher to fall prevention. We are proud of our commitment to preserving and enhancing the lives of those we serve through our many education and outreach programs. Sudden cardiac arrests and traumatic injuries involving substantial blood loss require immediate attention. Every second counts. The HeartSafe Community Program is designed to increase survival from sudden out-of-hospital cardiac arrest through public education. This vital program teaches the basics of early recognition, activation of the 911 system, initiating early CPR and defibrillation, and improving first responders' approach to managing sudden cardiac arrest. The Bleed Safe Community Program is designed to raise community awareness of the dangers of dramatic trauma events. Bleed Safe offers community trauma classes and provides public access trauma kits throughout the community. In addition, it ensures that first responders and receivers are trained and equipped to manage traumatic injuries. Automated external defibrillators or AEDs and trauma kits are now available throughout the community. This is thanks to the fine work of the Chino Valley Fire Foundation, individual donors, the Chino Police Foundation, Chino Valley Medical Center, and the Chino Hills Police Department and San Bernardino County Sheriff's Department. To date, more than 50 AEDs and 400 trauma kits have been installed in public locations. At Chino Valley Fire, we believe the public is the first step in strengthening the chain of survival from sudden cardiac arrest and dramatic trauma events. You have that security of knowing that the best trained people available are there to help you or a family member when your need is the greatest. And I think that's just unprecedented. It brings a great deal of security to our community. Historically, the Chino Valley Fire District has always maintained a stable financial position. Our revenue sources include property taxes, fees for contract services, and other miscellaneous proceeds. Recently, there has been a positive trend in revenue growth with both property tax revenue and contract revenue showing consistent gains from previous years. Overall, the Chino Valley Fire District has experienced a positive net change in fund balance, indicating a healthy and stable financial position. In addition to managing day-to-day -day operations, the district has proactively made investments to hedge against pension liabilities. These strategic investments aim to mitigate potential risks associated with pension obligations and ensure the long-term sustainability of the district's financial health. The district does a great job of using data to not only apply resources, but also do planning for the future. So when that's buying new equipment, placing new stations, they are working very closely with the partners, both Chino and Chino Hills and the County of San Bernardino to know where the population growth happens. 
to where responses are needed, more frequent responses are needed. The fire board and the city council, we interact all the time. We run into each other at the grocery stores and at, at different events that may not be specific for either one of our entities. We're always running into our fire board members who are also our neighbors here in the Chino Valley. The board of directors in Chino Valley Fire uh, are our neighbors. Some live in Chino, some live in Chino Hills. It's people that we see every day. We interact with them all the time. We do have official quarterly meetings. Uh, but we get together all the time, just we pass them when we're shopping in the grocery store. We have conversations all the time with them about our mutual concerns and what we need in our valley. And they're very ready and very willing to meet whatever we need and, and have conversations. And conversations are critical. Communication is critical in meeting the needs of our residents. And the board is very, very ready to meet our needs anytime we need.